When you travel far enough from civilization, the hardest part is not having any ice. Because when you spear a fish that's too big to eat in one day, like this, after stabbing it in the head and throwing it on the boat, the meat will spoil without proper refrigeration. But this is normal everyday life for the locals here. Who fillet it covered in salt, hang it over a fire, and leave it in the tropical sun for the next three days. But when they catch a fish, they don't stab it in the head like I did. Instead, they leave it alive in a pool of water in the bottom of the boat. Because the meat can't spoil if the fish is still breathing. Meanwhile, below the surface, we're looking for a much bigger target. That was a long shot, and it might break free. So I dive down to place a backup shot, because this fish is big. I wait until I'm close enough for a headshot, and even with two giant metal spears through its body, this fish is incredibly powerful. And I can't imagine pulling it up with my bare hands and no fishing rods like the locals. Anyways, after stabbing it in the head and putting it on the boat, we're reminded of the hardships of not having any ice by drinking warm beer. And remember that little fish alive in the bottom of the boat? Well, back on shore when the locals boil it for soup, it's still flopping around.